Good afternoon or good evening, everyone. Uh, welcome to Andi Musique. And uh, tonight we've got the Heart GP Jazz. That's Heart GP Jazz. This is our 311th live stream uh, since the pandemic started. And for everybody who's tuning in, thank you so much. It's, uh, it's good that you're out there. Uh, if you go online to andimusiclive.com, you can check out the schedule, everything that we have coming up. We have some great stuff over the next uh, number of weeks. Let me just point out that this weekend we have just a packed schedule. On Friday, uh, we have Brent Burkhead, Alan Johnson, Chris Fun, and Quincy Phillips. Uh, and then on Saturday, it's Benito Gonzalez, Michael Bowie, and Lee Pearson. And then on Sunday, I'll po also point out that Chris Barrick uh, and Alan Johnson will be back uh, with Elliot Sipa and Lenny Robinson. That Sunday show is, is uh, essentially three generations of great, great players in this area. And, uh, and this is just a weekend to be proud of uh, f for me. I just love when all these wonderful musicians are here. And this is such a wonderful way to kick this off with these guys. Um, let's get to it. Uh, Hart Guanjin Petit, Pettit. Uh, I knew I was going to get it wrong. I'm sorry, Hart. Uh, Christian Hazan, Tom Baldwin, Brendan Schnabel, Harry Appleman, and Joey Antico. Uh, everyone, enjoy.
very much ladies and gentlemen oh there's a little bit of amplification here I'll be careful uh, thank you so much once again the name of this ensemble that you are listening to both in person as well as tuning in virtually is the heart GP jazz group um, and the tune that you just heard was a composition written by saxophone player Oliver Nelson titled yearning it's an awesome kind of just down-home tune and uh, it's featured on the album originally titled Blues and the Abstract Truth. However, we're using a slightly different instrumentation today from that original recording. 
Before we go on and play a little bit more, I'm just going to take a quick moment and introduce the band that you are listening to from one side of the stage to the other. So here on piano, we've got Mr. Harry Appleman. Very thankful to be playing with him. Thank you. Holding it down on the trombone is Mr. Christian He's on, rocking out. Right behind me, I'll try and not stand in front of him for the feed, is uh, Mr. Tom Baldwin on the upright bass. Brendan Schnabel is to one side of me on the tenor saxophone, rounding out this horn section. And Joey Antico, the man himself, on drum set. <laughs> Thank you. My name is Hart Gunjan Pettit. The next tune that we're going to do is a composition written by the piano player Cedar Walton. It has two different names. It's titled Ugetsu, also known as Fantasy in D.
so much. I don't want to do too much talking, but I also want to make sure that the folks who are tuning in on the live stream are kind of tuned into what's going on. That tune was a Cedar Walton tune titled Fantasy in D, also known as Ugetsu. Um, we heard some awesome solos there, but we're going to keep things moving right along. This next tune is actually, despite it being fun to play, it's a bit of a drum feature. Uh, you're going to hear a whole lot from my you know, dear, dear friend, Mr. Joey Antico. Joey and I have known each other for a very long time. Uh, going back to being in almost the same exact college classes for the entirety of our duration in our undergraduate career. And he was with me every step of the way in you know, our mutual development, playing in ensembles at school, playing all sorts of goofy, silly gigs when they would come up, and we've continued to work together. I really enjoy it. You're going to hear him plenty on uh, the Duke Ellington tune composed by trombone player Juan Tizol, titled Caravan. Here's Caravan.
That was Mr. That was Joey Antico on the drums. Joey Antico, let's hear for Joey. Oh my gosh, man. So that was, um, once again, that was Caravan by Juan Teasel, Duke Ellington. Again, I don't want to do too much talking, but I want to keep everyone on the live stream tuned in. First of all, thank you all so much for coming out. We are so happy that we are able to play together once again. This music is one that is very communal in that every musician brings their own perspective to it and every audience member as well brings their own perspective to it. So thank you all for coming out and thank you to Andy Music for continuing to support live stream and in person uh, music during this time. Thank you to them for sure. We're gonna go right along now with a tune that's actually a pretty old tune. I really like this one. Uh, there are several famous recordings of Charlie Parker playing this tune, uh, very kind of heavily arranged, where there's a string orchestra and there's a whole lot going on. Uh, it's a tune composed by a very uh, kind of old style composer, Neil Hefty. Now you might recognize the name Neil Hefty as the uh, main arranger and composer for a lot of um, the Count Basie band. This tune is titled Repetition, and this tune is going to be cool because right up front, the first soloist that you're going to hear is Mr. Tom Baldwin on the bass. And a very, you know, awesome and unique and special thing about Tom, we're first of all very thankful to, to be playing together, but a lot of members of this ensemble actually, um, I think we're really very thankful to spend time studying with Tom at U University of Maryland at UMD. I know that like when I was in my undergrad and a little bit of my master's degree too before everything went online, I was always super thrilled to be um, uh, you know, under Tom's instruction and playing in an ensemble that he actually coached. Um, so here is Repetition by Neil Hefty.
That tune that you just heard, the last time we spoke, we were getting ready to play Repetition, and we talked about the fantastic Mr. Tom Baldwin. That tune that we just played was a composition written by the late, great, famous trumpet player, Mr. Clifford Brown. Um, we're going to continue to move right along here and actually play an interesting tune that's a little bit different than what we've been playing so far. This kind of, th this, this is a... This is a composition by a piano player named Tigran Hamasian. It's entitled Love Song, and this composition reflects my own personal Armenian heritage. I have really enjoyed exploring Tigran Hamasian's music. Um, I first heard him in 2015 when he visited the school that I was attending at the time, University of Maryland, and I've been really astonished by uh, everything that he has put out since. Uh, and this is a tune that I really enjoy of his entitled Love Song.
very much. Like I said, a little bit different uh, love song by piano player, Armenian piano player, Tigran Hamasian. We have two more tunes for you. Uh, we're going to kind of uh, wrap things up here in just a little bit. We want to thank you so much again once more for coming out both in person as well as tuning in to the live stream. Just a reminder that for the live stream link, this link will be good for seven days after today. And you can still, uh, you know, if you enjoyed the performance, send this to friends and family. They can still purchase a link for up to three days after today. Seven days after today is how long the live stream link is good for. And you can still purchase a live stream ticket for three days after today. We have two more tunes for you. Uh, Stardust by Hoagie Carmichael and Eternal Triangle by Sonny Stitt. Thank you so much for coming out.
We got one more tune for you. First off, let's hear it once again for on drums, Mr. Joey Antico. <laughs> on the tenor saxophone, Mr. Brendan Schnabel. <laughs> on bass, the incomparable Tom Baldwin. <laughs> Christian Hezon is holding it down on the trombone. <laughs> Harry Appleman is on piano. And my name is Hart Gunjan Pettit. Thank you so very much for tuning in and listening. This is a composition written by Sonny Stitt titled The Eternal Triangle.